What's up, YouTube? So basically, I unscrewed this screw from here, holding this in place. So I think it runs smoother without it for now. So I rigged up these two uh, capacitors, they're 25 volt each, DC capacitors. And I don't think it's amping up the voltage any. I think it's just still the regular current passing through, but it's getting cleaned. And it increased a, a little bit in power, I think. It's definitely running a lot cleaner frequency. Let's turn this on. The motor, everything sounds much smoother now. Instead of jumping around. And the bulb's looking a little bit brighter. Looking a little bit brighter there. And basically I just moved this over a little bit. And picked up some uh, brightness coming out of there. We even got reflections here, here. So it's definitely a... Uh, got some brightness to it, you know? Everything is black here. It's, I mean, it is daylight out, so... Basically, what I'm gonna do is uh, do a video at night this time. So I'm gonna keep this video short. I just wanna show you this little update I did here. It's the ground right there, so I'm not gonna touch both of them. <laughs> Even though it is only 12 volts or 15 volts, whatever it is coming out, I don't know. Both of my uh, multi... I, I went through four multimeters ever since I started the Gerard Morin pump system, you know? <laughs> so this, the next one is going to be the big one, where I'll be able to check everything without blowing the thing, you know? So anyway... Connections coming out, going in into the light. And if you're looking for these, I'll tell you where you can get them. You get them from the uh, ceiling fans, the ceiling fan lights. Some of them have four, some have five or six, you know. And that's where you get them from. So you know. I'm sure there's other ways to get them, but uh, that's where I get mine from. You get them from lamps also. This was a double lamp that I got the uh, so outlets for socket for these uh, light bulbs. So there's, there's ways of getting them, but I found that the ceiling fans, you get a lot more at once, especially if you're changing out your ceiling fan, you want to save a few of these uh, uh, sockets for the lights, you know, you got them. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll do an update later on at night. And just to see if this bulb got any brighter than last time or not. And one more thing. This was attached, uh, I guess these are rectifiers. These were attached to, from positive to negative. They got so hot that it cracked. Let me give you a good shot of that here. The insulation cracked off it. And here's the other piece. So, yeah. Now if I turn the motor, you can see, it gets dim, right? And once I find that good spot, picks up the uh, light much better right there all right thanks for watching it's just a little update here and I'm planning on doing this thing uh, I'm gonna be searching for a uh, step up inverter for this and I already made this spark app uh, it's a little bit difficult, but once you get that going just right, it works out really good. 